This distinctive green glow of the interstellar comet 3i Atlas was first observed on the night of September 7th, 2025. The discovery was made by astrophotographers Michael Jäger and Gerald Rehmann, who captured images of the comet from Namibia during the total lunar eclipse that occurred on that date. The unique conditions of the eclipse, with the moon's light dimmed, provided an exceptionally dark sky allowing for detailed observations that revealed the unexpected green hue of the comet's coma, the cloud of gas and dust surrounding its nucleus. In comets from our own solar system, a green coma is typically caused by diatomic carbon molecules fluorescing under sunlight. However, earlier observations of 3A Atlas by telescopes like the James Webb Space Telescope had shown it to be strongly carbon chain depleted meaning it had very low levels of the very molecules usually responsible for such a glow. This leaves astronomers with a mystery. The green glow was visually present, but the usual chemical suspect was missing. The leading theories to explain this are 1. The diatomic carbon is present, but was previously undetected, perhaps because it was trapped and has only recently been released as the comet heats up on its approach to the sun. Two. The green color is being produced by a different molecule or an unknown chemical process which would make 3i Atlas a truly unique object with chemistry not commonly seen in our solar system. It should be noted though that our last spectroscopic observations took place before the green glow was observed, so dicarbon might not have been visible then, but would be visible now. This whole mystery could very well hinge on a lack of data that is likely to be rectified soon enough. We'll just have to wait and see. But oh, it's a commonly known fact that aliens make everything green, so this must be proof of aliens. No. <laughs>